travel is now more accessible than ever, but getting from A to B can still be confusing. 46 million passengers pass through Munich Airport each year, bringing 1.5 billion euros in revenue from travel and shopping activities. A very outstanding honour for us was that we were named um, the world's um, best airport terminal in 2017. But finding the best method of mixing wayfinding and commercial signage can be tricky. Wayfinding is uh, essential for passenger processes, so you want to make sure that there's no advertisement um, getting the attention away from important wayfinding signage. We had particular interest in finding out whether um, passengers do actively perceive on the one hand um, certain campaigns, advertising spaces, also the messages that we try to um, communicate from an airport perspective. And uh, on the other hand, we were actually running a test phase with um, special signage that was attached to the floor. To get answers, the airport hired Toby Pro to run an eye tracking study using wearable technology, which captured the gaze of travellers as they made their way from security to their departure gate or other destinations. So we knew how many people were actually um, passing by a certain point in the terminal. Uh, but of course we didn't know what people, wh what they looked at and I think this is um, a very good method to find out more about the actual, actual attention of the passenger. The data was collected over four days and then analysed to establish if signage was visible, if it was actually viewed by travellers and if they understood it. We actually found out um, using the eye tracking method that if there was uh, for example, a sign that said you can go to 25 further shops and restaurants at gates K. They totally ignored all other information that was not relevant to their gate where they were. When you compare it, for example, to methods like surveys, um, eye tracking is well, way more objective when it comes to measuring um, the attention, but also the understanding of uh, signage. The results inform changes like the removal of floor navigation and changes to the nature of dynamic digital signage. I would definitely recommend um, eye tracking as a, as a study method. I think uh, anywhere, um, if you work, for example, in the um, out-of-home advertising market uh, or in, in public spaces like we do, then this is definitely a big advantage of, of eye tracking to get deeper insights.